Welcome to App Palette, where innovation meets practicality in social media automation. Today, we are going to guide you through the steps and setup of using the only working bot on Reddit, that is App Palette's Reddit Karma Bot. You can start automating your Reddit interactions with your desired inputs, which I'll go into a briefer detail later in the video. First of all, the first step is go to the console. I'm using the console link. Then you have to sign up. If you haven't already, you can use everything that is written on to here, the email and password. You can add on to the Discord username if you want to. And you can set how many devices you want to automate at the time. I'm going to skip this step because uh, I've already signed up and I'm going to log in into my email and password. So this is your dashboard where you can automate multiple platforms. But I'm going to show you the tutorial of how you can add your phone to access the Reddit Karma board, which is basically what this video is about. So to add your phone, you can go into the source section and click on add to phone. Now you have a pop up window where you can see you can download the APK. You can download the APK on your current desktop where you're accessing the ball right now, which you'll see in a second how it's going to be downloaded. Or you can just copy its link address and send it to your phone via WhatsApp or email and you can directly download it from there. Or you could just send it from your desktop to your phone and download. I'll show you how to download and install from a link. Okay, once you got your link through your WhatsApp or your email, you can click onto the link and it will go take you to a pop-up of download the app palette. And you can click on the download button and download anyway. And you can wait for the download to get finished. Once it has been installed and sign in to the exact credentials you entered onto your desktop. You can enter the credentials from the desktop and sign in to your account on your phone onto the app palette account. Uh, it will take you to a window that says you're all set for automation and you notice the green light on top. It states that your device has been added to the desktop and ready to automate. Okay, once you have downloaded Apple's app on your phone, you can come back to the dashboard on your laptop or your desktop and you can click onto the store to start automating your Reddit Karma bot. For that, you can click onto the Reddit Karma bot card and it will take you to another window where you can create a task and you can name your task any viable thing you want. If you want to remember it and you have multiple devices you want to automate, name it something unique so you remember it for the later parts. I'm going to name it test one and I'm going to continue. So it will take you to another window where you can see a different option of inputs you can enter from which you can decide what and how to use your Karma bot. So I'm going to take you through some of the functionalities or the inputs so you can be clear of what you can enter and what not. It will give you a number of uh, options in scrolling and upward or downward, a random post, comment on a random post. So basically the scrolling is of four types. You can endlessly down scroll for a specific amount of time that you set. You can scroll and pause like a the real human and mimicking the data from a real human. Basically, the board learns data and he mimics it. A reverse scroll is self-explanatory. Micro scroll up and down on a post. It's basically selecting a desired post and scrolling through the post and looking at just the comments. That's it. It's a part of scrolling. So an upward and downward on a random post, it can quick upward and it can download on the spammy or the misleading uh, comments that you can you can set it to download to use three types of comment options to use uh, to gain karma in total because this is a karma farming bot so you can use quick comment which basically means reading throughout the thread and onto the top reddit for uh, contributors post and generating a two to three word comment that's short and and direct it towards all of the thread and it's engaging and uh, the detailed response is basically a detailed response of of all the valuation of all the comments in that thread and making a better comment that is a, in a detailed response and reply to a comment is basically a short to medium state of that comment reply to a single specific person 
it's basically the top ended person that that gained most of the upvotes in that thread and you can set it to uh, normal user speed and extensive user speed so this is a major function you can look at a table and you can decide whether you want the comma farming board to be normal or extensive according to its per hour comment features so a normal per hour feature is one one comment every 12 to 30 minutes and up for one to two six minutes if you want to gain extensive farming in uh, karma you can set it to the extensive feature and if you want a normal speed and you want to warm up the bot warm up the uh, reddit account so finally cutting short to setting the inputs and we want set out the inputs according to whatever you want the bot to do so i'm gonna select the desired options that i want the bot to perform and uh, we're gonna skip downward we're gonna select Quick comment to check out how the board comments looking at specific threads, reading out the post and commenting a short comment that's desirable in two to three words, which in turn is going to gain you karma. You can select the inputs and click on next. From where in the previous steps you've added the device, you can select the device you want to automate you read it uh, board on and click on next schedule the body we actually have two types of options you can select from a fixed runtime where you can set the amount of hours or even minutes you, if you want to set it for five minutes you can write here five and it will the board will run for five minutes you can also set custom daily runtime for your board let's say you, if you want the board to run for four hours daily and you don't want to go onto the settings and put on inputs every time you go onto the desktop to run your automated Reddit bot. You just can set custom daily runtime. Let's say you want it to run for four and a half hours and you set the starting and ending time according to that, three hours or four hours. So in, in the case, if you want it to run for a fixed amount of time, you can say, I want it to run for 30 minutes today. And you're gonna set that time for today let's say it's 8 40 8 40 right now so i want the board to start automating at 8 41 so i'm gonna save all these details and i'm gonna i want my board to run at a fixed run time with all the inputs that are provided i'm gonna click on next i'm gonna make sure i entered all my inputs correctly especially one of those comment, comment ones because you want if you're using the extensive features onto the table you want to make sure that you're going to get the inputs right when the user when the bot comments onto your reddit account so everything is checked the fixed run time is checked and the time that the bot will start automating will be 841 now you can simply click on to save and start and wait for the bot to start automating come onto your phone and you can wait for the design that you set and it would start exactly at the time that you set and scheduled for the bot to run now looking at the behavior of the bot it basically mimics everything that a human would do so a quick scroll down a scroll and pause that's another quick scroll down and it would stop and look on to the post as a user would do because the learning strips are basically mimicking real human beings you can see it did an upvote because i have set the users to do upwards i scroll down more posts and find the perfect comment post on Once it has find the post, it will go on to the comments and read the comments one by one, take it into ChatGPT or into its database, collecting information for what's the structure of all the comments that are getting upwards look like. Once it gathers the right amount of data for commenting onto the perfect comment that is short in three words and relevant to all of the comments that have been done before it will go on 
if we go on to the comment box write a comment down in three or four words and post the comment and you can see it's really relevant to the other posts and the rest of the comments and we continued on scrolling because it is sent on endless scrolling till the desired amount of time that we have set so in our case we have set the bot at three to four minutes it would come down to a conclusion at the three or four minute mark basically how you can use our app pilot's karma farming bot in easy steps for a better warm up sequence and karma farming that has plausible and tested ways to gain more karma quicker. If you have any questions according to the board, you can directly join our Discord server and message us on the Telegram and create any issues on the GitHub repository. If you use the board and you face any issue, we'd be happily willing to help you guys. Thank you for sticking with us throughout the tutorial of Red Karma Bot and we'll see you in the next.